It's time for Critters on Cage with Miller Park Zoo. Zoo educator Julia Benzel and Amada, the three-banded armadillo, who is just shivering. I know you can't tell it, but is shaking its little paws off. Welcome back. Thank you. Introduce us. This is Amada. She's a three-banded armadillo. She's named for those three bands right here. Those help her expand and contrast when she walks. Her little shaking claws, those are because she's so excited. <laughs> she does, I know, she's as excited as we are. Uh, she does really well sitting here, but that's her telling me, let me run around. Oh. Let me find some insects, because that's what she eats, mainly ants and termites. She has a crazy strong sense of smell. She can smell a worm six inches under the dirt. Wow. Whoa, my mm -hmm. goodness. Does she have, like, hair? It looks like she has, she has hair. hair. That's what tells us she's a mammal. So in her soft, squishy belly area which is not offensive, I promise. Okay. <laughs> um, that's where her hair is at. And when they're born, they have hair all over their body, but then it hardens so that she has this armor, which is what they're named for. Armor, armadillo. Yes. Are these, they, she can form to a full ball and roll. Is that right? There are about 20 species of armadillo. There is one species of armadillo. Amada. <gasps> oh! That Whoa. completely comes together and fits together like a little puzzle piece. And that's the three-banded armadillo. Oh wow. My goodness. And she can hold herself in that position for hours. She has crazy strong abdominal muscles. So um, if something's trying to eat her, they can't. Huh. Wow. So she literally becomes like a like a, mm -hmm. a rock. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And then she lays on her side and doesn't move, so she looks like a rock too. Wow. Okay. Yeah, Do they cool. have good eyesight? Because it looks like her little eyes look like maybe we're kind of squinting, but maybe I'm just... No, I don't know. You're very observant. Okay. Um, they're on the side of her head, and if you see, they're covered here by the sides of her front plate. Yeah. And then she has this plate on the front of her face. That's like a helmet. That she's protects well her armored. when she runs into things. Oh, <laughs> so that mm -hmm. must happen a lot. <laughs> but what's really cool about that front plate is it's just like our fingerprints. So that is unique to her, the design on the front of her face. Wow. Really and cool. where is a three-banded armadillo found? So they're found in South America, okay. Argentina, Brazil, Paraguay. So not in Texas. No, that's a nine-banded armadillo. So if she's a three-banded, a nine-banded is okay. like this big. Oh my goodness. Okay, well, I want to make sure we mention all of the fun things that you have happening oh, at the zoo. Sweet. Opportunities to come say hi to Amada, because we are starting off with this week, the pollinators rock. What's happening? Mm -hmm. They are talking all things pollinators, showing what we have to promote natural pollinators and what our native pollinators are doing right now in the season at the zoo. Very okay. cool. Also, Endangered Species Day. Yep, so that's filled with keeper talks and talking at exhibits about our endangered species. And there's a scavenger hunt that Ooh. day with, I believe, some goodies if you complete it. Ooh, Very nice. Cool. Okay, all about the mini golf. That sounds so fun. <laughs> yeah, last year it was a huge hit. I think that was the first year they did it. And it was very popular. So we are telling people sign up ahead of time for that. But because it's at twilight. Twilight, yeah, exactly. That's wow. super cool. Oh, that's very unique at a zoo. Oh, and then also, uh, it sounds like a movie night, family movie night. Yeah, they're doing zoovies again, but so they're cute. pairing up with the, zoo, uh, the library. Okay. And they, you can get free tickets through the library, or you can call and get tickets from the zoo. But they're playing Lyle Lyle Crocodile with, you can get zoo concessions and watch the movie with your family. I very love cool. that idea. And that's happening on June 2nd and 3rd from 8 to 10. Well, it sounds like there's other exciting things happening with a new exhibit. There's yeah. other animals I think we have pictures here of. What is that? Whoa. Okay, so you see that little one on her back? Not really. I just <laughs> see one big thing. You see one big thing. And yes. then if you look in the middle, there's that. Okay. That tail. That's Chili. Chili oh. is now full grown. She is um, in transport to our zoo, and she is going to be our giant anteater. And that's how she relates to Amada. That's why I brought her. They are part of the Xenarthra uh, um, Amada is order. so excited. <laughs> yeah. Go. Um, so those anteaters and sloths and armadillos are all part of a group. So she's coming <laughs> to represent for her new bestie gal, Chili, who's oh. coming to 
to our new exhibit, <gasps> our South America exhibit. Oh my God. I know. Like, Let's oh, party. Oh, oh, yes, yes. Oh my word. Thank you so much for yes, coming, thank introducing you. us. <laughs> Lots of fun things happening over at Miller Park Zoo. There's a look at their website where you can learn more. And of course, we will connect you over on our website after today's show. <laughs> All right, guys.